Mac Help Tosh making a follow-up video on the Microsoft Office 2011 review. As you can see here, the finalized Microsoft software folder is very cool looking. They have ribbons of all four different colors representing their softwares and it's just very eye-pleasing. This is probably the last beta build of the Office 2011. Finalized, built, finalized apps of the suite is Document Connection, Excel, Microsoft Outlook, PowerPoint, and Word. Now, what Document Connection does is that it allows you to connect to your Live.com SkyDrive and upload your documents to Live.com SkyDrive where you can share with other people or take it down uh, or download it from an other computer when you're not at your home computer or your office computer that is somehow similar to the mo uh, mobile me and iwork.com service that the Mac has that Apple has and of course Excel is for it's like numbers in iwork and it does calculations and tables in cells and makes graphs Outlook is an email client with a calendar in it, calendar client too, so you can share uh, calendars or share notes and I think you can also manage project. And here's PowerPoint which is one of the best presentation software, but I still prefer Keynote. And last but not least, the Word, Microsoft Office Word and it's one of the most famous word processing software. Here, here are the other apps they have included Microsoft Messenger and Microsoft Communicator. Basically uh, Microsoft Messenger and Communicator are almost the same thing except the Communicator allows you to designate a server of your own or that the company has used so that you can communicate with between colleagues uh, better and safer and with more performance and I think after six months of beta test testing I think this time Microsoft Office 2011 has proven the strength of Microsoft in, de in developing Office suites but the funny thing is that they keep poning themselves by making a better Office Suite for Mac than Windows. For example, Office for Mac uh, 2004 is way better than 2003. It's like it's like a five to it's like a ten and a five, where ten is for Mac and five, or maybe even lower is for PC. And I don't know why. And this happens this time too. Um, oh, and the 2008 version and 2007 version they're pretty similar but I think 2008 still pones 2007 and lastly 2011 like pwned 2010 like a huge gap like it's way better maybe it's their marketing strategy I don't really know but maybe it really it is because maybe they want maybe Microsoft would like to partner again with Apple, but I don't know, Steve Jobs wouldn't like them anyway. And <clears throat> anyway, comments below. Please feel free to comment about this build. Comment rather it's really better than any suite in the world, or if iWork or other suites are still uh, superior. Please subscribe to watch any of my future reviews and tech tips and like the video if you enjoyed it. This is Macaptosh and I'll talk to you later.